And sometimes, in the time we pray, all kinds of negative thoughts are attacking us. And the person is trying to elevate some simple requests, some simple blessings, just to say the 18 blessings of Tfilat Shmona Esre, or to do a short Idbudadut, a personal prayer and talking to Hashem. In that time, while we're trying to focus our mind in a holy way and to aim our heart to our Maker, it's very common that many negative thoughts or mundane thoughts are trying to find their way into our mind. The deeper truth of that situation is that your prayer in that time that you are able to aim your heart and to pray with the right intention is as a pillar of fire that is rising up to heaven and it's so pure and so holy that all those thoughts that does not have no connection to the prayer they also want to be redeemed and that's why they are trying to push themselves into your path and your way to uplift them is to bring back your mind into the simple intention of the prayer and by that you are joining them up the road in the Jacob ladder up to the heaven. So when those thoughts are trying to distract you, trying to reject you from your sim simple prayer, you should just put more effort into aiming the simple meaning of each word of the prayer. Every word that you say with the right intention is uplifting and rising sparks from ancient times, from ancient days. And therefore the tefillah, the prayer, is so important. Think about the power of your words. May we understand this simple lesson and keep it and practice it to dedicate every day simple time for prayers for the Shmona Isla prayer, for Kriyat Shema, for blessings for food and other things of the day and as well for the individual prayer that is called Hid Bodedut talking to Hashem like you talk to your best friend asking your requests telling Him your stories sharing your feelings, begging for salvation atoning and confessing for Tshuva expressing your pain, your sorrow, your regret all your thoughts like that you will talk to your best and loving friend and the prayers of an honest person who will talk from the heart words of truth will surely be answered because Hashem is close to everyone to everyone who calls him with truth may all our prayers be answered in no time in our days and in the days of all our loved ones Amen Welcome to Freedom Through Faith.